Why do you Zwift? To get fitter during a winter season? To feel the thrill of competition while racing? To hang out with your friends on the group rides? That all may be true, but there is one more reason why I do Zwift. I'm striving to collect more and more badges. As you may know, Zwift offers a few categories of achievements. General achievements, cycling specific achievements, route completions achievement, and extra credits. These badges are hidden until you unlock them. One of such is this 100k per hour badge. Not a brainer, what you have to do to unlock it is to ride at the speed of 100 km per hour or more. But how to do this? Well, there is a known method of doing so. My name is Daniel Boydo and in this video we'll earn this badge together. But before we start, just a little disclaimer. That's not my original idea. This method has been known for the years now, but I first learned it from Shane Miller of GP Lama channel. I've put the link to his original video in the description. All clear? Let's get started then. Step number one. This badge is all about the speed, so you want to make sure you use the proper tool for the job. You may think that the best choice is one of the time trial bikes, like Pinarello Bolite PT or something similar, but actually it's not. And that's because time trial bikes cannot benefit from some of the Zwift features like power-ups and drafting. That's why I'm using this S-Work Venge equipped with DT Swiss disc wheels. You can have both of them from the drop shop. Okay, the bike is sorted, now let's use it. Step number two. This solution requires taking a very specific route. So we want to go to Watopia and I'll start in Volcano Circuit. Step number three. I've already mentioned the power-ups. The best one supporting the seat is AeroBoost, aka Helmet. It basically reduces your aerodynamic drag by 25% for 15 seconds. So let's try to earn one. I'll try to do this by completing the Volcano circuit. Here we are, the aero boost is ours. Actually, I'm pretty lucky to get it at the first shot. Sometimes it may take some time to earn it, but definitely it's worth the effort. So keep trying until you get it. Okay, we are fully equipped and now we can move to step number four, which is heading into radio tower of bonus climb of Epic KON. In my case, the shortest route leads through the reverse Epic KON. Let's go there then. Don't push too hard on this climb. We don't want to run out of gas just yet. Actually, we still need a full tank where we're up there. So pace yourself carefully. Epic KOM done. Now we're turning right into the bonus climb. Go, go, go. Just a few feet more. Okay, that was a long climb. Now, step 5. Take a short break to recover and catch your breath. Fresh like a daisy? Good, let's start descending. Gain some speed on this plateau, but don't go too hard just yet. Okay! Deploy the power up and we go all in! Don't hold back! Push, push, push! And here we are! Congrats! You just unlock your 100k bad Congrats, you've got yet another badge in your trophy case. That's all what I had for you today. 
I hope you find this video useful. If so, please drop a like and subscribe to my channel. Did you succeed on this batch? Or maybe you know the other method of earning it? Please let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching and see you next time.